Hello guys, in this video, let's confirm that ordering or first in first out is not guaranteed in service bus. So we will send total 1500 messages in three batches through console app and we will read these messages in service bus trigger Azure function and then we can observe that messages are not retrieved in sequence and in upcoming video, we will use session for FIPO guarantee. So this is our queue that is test queue and you see message count is zero. Now guys, this is our console app, which will send those 1500 messages in three batches. So uh, this will send first 500 messages, second 500 messages, and then this one third 500 messages. And most importantly, we will be sending these messages in sequence. And you see the message content, it will be message hyphen that index that is message zero, message one, message two, message three. So we will be sending messages in sequence. Now this is the function which will trigger or which will run whenever a message arrives in that queue. So guys, you don't need to have any knowledge of Azure functions. It's simple and straightforward code. So basically we have just added this connection string for that service bus queue over here in local settings file and then we are using it in this connection property okay and then this test underscore queue is the name of the queue in which messages will be sent okay and you see here we are not doing anything okay we have simply added a debugger on line number 70 so that whenever a message arrives in the queue this function will be executed and we can check the contents of this my queue atom that is the contents of that service bus message okay now let's run this function so that it keeps listening for newer messages so let's run it Now you say it's running so that now it's listening for the messages to arrive in that service bus queue. Now let's run this console app so that it can send those 1500 messages to the service bus queue. Let's run it. Now you can see the debugger has been hit. That means messages are sent to the service bus queue. Let's check in portal first. So if I simply refresh it, you see message count, it shows 1500 and now let's go to the function. So if I go here, see the debugger has been hit and if I check the contents, see directly we got message two. Let me continue. See now we got message one. See we got message three. That means we are not receiving the messages in sequence. Okay. And now in our upcoming video, we will use sessions to implement this FIFO.